Hey family, welcome back or welcome to Lin Lin. Thank you guys for coming to check out the video today. I'm about to head into Target this morning. I have not shopped in Target for a very, very long time. And I just wanna go in here and see pretty much what I can find. I'm on a $50 budget and I just wanna go in here and see what I can get. I have a couple things in mind that I do wanna get out of here or see like what the prices are in here for them. Kind of sick of going to Winco. I just wanted to try out something different today. I just wanna see what I can get for under $50 or $50, like that is my cutoff. So guys, let's go in here and let's see what we can find, see what kind of deals they have. I've actually never shopped in Target's food department. I've gone in there here and there and grabbed like a little snack or something, but I've never actually grocery shopped in here. So guys, let's go in here on this $50 budget and let's see what we can get. All right, let's go. I'm just gonna grab a little basket today. Oops, somebody left their stuff in here. These are cute. Five dollars for these right here. They have this one right here that says gather. They got some pumpkin ones down there, some little witch hats. This one right here is a little skull. Over here, this is their $3 bin. No, there's $3 and $5 right here. These are Christmas decorations. They got a bunch of little knickknack things right here. These are little plaques for the walls, I'm guessing. These ones right here are cute. These are ornaments. Some little ornaments right here. Come over here. These are little cups. Is this a cup? This says, I don't know if this is a cup or what this is. Ice cream man, so it's an ice cream. Okay, it's an ice cream cone. This is cute, you put your ice cream right there. That's a skull one. This one's a skull one as well. This is a little cup right here. $3 for that. You got some pumpkins down there. There's some stuff over here. These are all a dollar. I think these are just little plushy things. There's some gingerbread man, some snowmans, penguins. You got some dogs over here. There's a few little things over here. There's some, some throws down here for $5. These are dish towels, two in a set. These are $5. It says Merry Merry Warm Winter Wishes. What is this? 70, 72 count of some little building blocks. Okay, that's different. This is some little car thing. You got some little things right here for kids, little activity packs that are $3. This is some dough, like Play-Doh right here. For, these are like goodie bag things right here, actually. Those are all a dollar. These little grab bag things right here are all a dollar. Coming over here, they just got a little bit of everything, y'all. A little bit of everything. What is this? A light up necklace? Okay. This little light up necklace thing. There's a couple cups right here. Those are all cute. Those are $3. See, this is all Halloween stuff right here. These are all $1, $3, $5 down there. They got a bunch of stuff over here. These are like Halloween games. Yes. You got your costumes and everything over here. They got this huge inflatable. They have a bunch of costumes in here, y'all. They got this inflatable with this. This is actually cool. I like this. That is cool. The pumpkin playing the guitar. It's costumes, little kid costumes, baby costumes, bunch of costumes, bunch of costumes. Halloween stuff over here. They have several aisles of Halloween stuff in here, actually. They are not playing in Target. They are very neat, I'll tell you that much. You know what, while I'm in here, I wanna see if they have some um, turkey, no, not turkey. I wanna see if they have chicken sausage, no, chicken patties. 
I want to see if they have chicken patties, but I don't actually see them over here. They have these ground beef patties, seasoned steakhouse ground beef patties for $8.99. There's four of them in there. This right here says 10 burgers for $10. That's not bad. This is, uh, what is this, grass fed? So their prices are not that bad. I always thought Target was just expensive, but as I'm looking, their prices aren't too bad and they're not too far off than the, you know, the regular stores, like the regular grocery stores. This is a cracked peppercorn crusted beef sirloin petite steaks. There's two of those in there for $11.17. You got some ribs right here. These are $7.33. There's some sausage down there. There's some little petite steaks right here. These ones are $9 for two of those. Over here, they got a couple things. They got the turkey. The turkey is $4.99. That's not bad. There's a little bit of chicken right here. The chicken is, mm, the chicken is $13.94. But looking over here, I know they used to have like these ready-made meals. There they are. This one is sheet pan nachos, and it's a whole meal in a bag. Let me get it so you guys can see. I've been in here and seen this thing before. $16 for this, and it comes with, you have the chips, the cheese, the can of corn. I'm gonna take everything out so you guys can see. The chips, you have this taco dip right here. It says made with sour cream, cream cheese, salsa, and jalapeno peppers. That actually sounds really good. I might have to find this dip in here. And then you have a can of beans. So this is a whole meal kit, minus the meat, if you want meat. This is just for, and this is for $16. Sheet pan nachos. They also have this broccoli and chicken, no, broccoli chicken mac and cheese. This one right here is $17. Let's see what's in this. You have broccoli. You have macaroni and cheese. This is some grilled chicken breast strips. And then a package of cheese. So actually this is not bad for this little kit right here. I would rather get this one versus the the sheet pan nachos, $17 for that. And it looks really good. Of course, it's always gonna look better on there than it would when you actually make it. But these are ready to cook dinner in minutes, little kits right there. And it says it serves three ready in 10 minutes. Coming over here, they got some meatballs. They also got some, what is this? Steakhouse seasoned beef patties. These are all, those are $13.49. The meatballs are all $5.99. They got the corn dogs here for $7.39. For the mini ones, the regular ones are, what, $3.99 for the six count? That's actually not bad. And then $7.99 for the bigger one. All their salads are buy one, get one 20% off. Do I need a salad? Let's see, their salads are $3.49 for the kids, and I think that's pretty much around the same price that it is in um, Winko or in Fred Meyer. So, you know what, I think I'm gonna get one of the chopped Caesar salads. I got a chopped Caesar salad, and I think I only want one, so I'm just gonna get one of those, but those are $3.49 coming over here they have all their little breads right here they got the sweet um king's hawaiian rolls there's some other breads there's a uh, nan breads right here these ones are these don't have a price on them oh their fruit looks pretty good their grapes don't look bad it's 5.99 for the whole package so it's a two pound package of grapes oh wait one says $5.99, the other one says $4.49. So this one is $4.50 for this pack. And then by the pound, they are $2.99. Their strawberries are $3.19. Then the big one is $5.79. I think I'll get a pack of strawberries if I can find one that looks decent because strawberries have been a hit or miss lately. These 
ones right here don't look bad. So I'll grab these, $3.19 for the strawberries. So I'm already at about, what, $5 and some change. The blackberries are $3.69 and then this one is $6.69. I know they're a little bit cheaper at Fred Meyer, so I'll pass on the blackberries in here. So one of the things that I might look for while I'm in here, I know that I wanna make some um, salmon and I bought salmon, but I want another package of it. I wanna make some bang bang salmon. And so I need to see if I can find the ingredients for that while I'm in here, I might as well. So I don't have to go to another store. Let's see, they got, this is that, is this the one that I seen over there? No, this one's a different one. This one is buffalo style chicken dip made with white meat chicken, cream cheese, ranch dressing, cayenne pepper, and blue cheese. That would sound good minus the blue cheese. I don't care for blue cheese. This one's a Mexican style street corn dip made with roasted corn, green chilies, cheddar, and co cojita teas. And this one is a pimento cheese dip. So I don't see the one that was actually over in that kit thing. What is this? Barbecue hummus, new. I have never seen this. Okay, I guess I wouldn't because it says that it's new. Barbecue hummus. They also have Southwest hummus and then they have this Buffalo Frank's Red Hot hummus. You know what, I think I might try one of these. These are only $2.99. I definitely don't want barbecue. Maybe the Southwest hummus. $2.99 for that, that's not bad. I'm gonna try this one right here. The Southwest hummus, I have some pretzel chips that I can eat with this. Or I could get the Nan. No, I think I'll just stick to getting this and I'll just eat it with pretzels. Okay, so over here is their seafood. Let's see, they got Alaskan sockeye salmon fillets, wild caught, these are $12.99. Um, it doesn't say how many are in the package. This one right here is the same Alaskan Keta salmon fillets. I've never even heard of that. Keta. Have you guys heard of that? If you have, leave a comment down below. That one's new to me. These are all the same ones. These are $13.99. These are farm Atlantic salmon. I don't want that. Um, they got cod right there. That's $11.99. This one right here is $9.99. Um, these ones down here are a little bit cheaper. These ones in here are $9.99. So I think I'm gonna pass on the salmon and actually go and get it from Winko because it is only $7 and I think 19 cents or something like that at Winko for it. And I wanna say it's about the same amount in there. They also have shrimp over here. Their shrimp is, uh, I wanna say it's about a dollar more than me getting it at Winko, but I don't need shrimp. But these ones are $7.99 for the jumbo. And then these are extra jumbo. Okay, I've never seen extra jumbo. Or you know what it's called? No, these are Colossal right here. So they got Colossal, Jumbo, and Extra Jumbo. Okay, but they all look to be the same size. Oh, the difference is these ones are cooked, these ones are raw. But the Colossal ones are $9.99, that's not bad. And then the Jumbo ones are $7.99. I'm gonna get one of these Jumbo Coconut Shrimp things. $8.99 in here, that's pretty much the same price they are. Um, and Winko, geez, it was stuck in there. $8.99 on sale. And I get these, my husband loves this jumbo coconut shrimp, so I'm gonna get these for him. I'm trying to stay under $50, y'all. Oh, you know what, I need some toothpaste. So I'm gonna grab some toothpaste out of here as well. I'm just looking over here to see what they have. I don't see anything that I really want over here. These are all just TV dinners. Yeah, I don't see anything I want. If you guys are ever looking for a good TV dinner, that's like this brand right here. I've tried this butter chicken one right here. That one, really, really good. Literally tastes just like you would get it if you were, you know, getting it um, from a place selling butter chicken. Oh, you know what? While I'm in here, let me see if they have some chocolate coconut milk. You know what, I don't even think they sell chocolate coconut milk. It would be nice if they did, but 
everywhere I go, I seem to not be able to find it. So it just might not be a thing. And as I'm looking, I don't see, I don't see any um, coconut milk at all, actually. No, I only see, oh, there's that coconut milk. And that's all I see. Okay, so no coconut milk in there. They have these true fruits in here. These are really, really good. And I had the strawberry ones, um, the chocolate ones. And honestly, guys, I got like three of them out of there before everybody else just ate them all up. But they have the banana ones right here. And then they have the pina colada ones. Okay, so those are the pineapples and white chocolate and coconut. That one right there sounds really good. Mm. $7.29 for those. And those are always priced that much, pretty much everywhere you go coming over here to this frozen part this is all their frozen fruit their frozen fruit is not bad price $7.69 for the ones up on top and then these ones are $12.99 or $12.69 these are $9.59 $9.79 there's a couple things over here waffles and whatnot pizzas over here I don't need anything from over here so I'm just gonna head to another aisle and see what I can find the muffins are $3.99 in here. They have the limited edition pumpkin ones. Would you guys try those or have you guys tried those? I'm not a big pumpkin fan, but if you have tried them, leave a comment down below. Actually, what is your favorite Intamins? My favorite are the banana muffins right here. I really, really like those ones. When I have purchased them, the kids like the chocolate chip ones, but mine are the banana ones. So for the bang bang salmon, I need um, sriracha and I need chili, um, sweet chili sauce. And I don't know if I'll be able to find that in here, but I am going to look. And I don't see anything over here yet that looks like it. Okay, here we go. Is there any sriracha in here? This is the hot sauce. This is where it would be. But honestly, I don't see it. Okay. So, no, I'm definitely going to have to go to Winko to get my sriracha. This one right here is sriracha. This is Melinda's brand. I've never heard of that one. So, because I've never heard of it, I'm probably not going to get it because I don't know if it tastes like the original sriracha or what. So... I'm gonna pass on that. Oh, you know what? Here it is, y'all. I came over to this aisle. This says beans. I guess this is like the international aisle or something right here. And they have it, sriracha. $4.99 for the sriracha. And then I also need the sweet chili sauce. Let me see if they have the one that I'm looking for. What is this? This one is chili crunch sauce. That's not the one I need, and that one is $10.39. Over here, they have my sweet and sour sauce. I love that sauce. They have this sweet chili. Oh, this is sweet Thai. So that's not the one I'm looking for. Okay. So they have the sriracha, but I don't see anything else in my basket so far. My basket's getting kind of heavy, y'all. I probably should have got a regular basket, but... I'm on a $50 budget, like I said, so I don't need to be getting a big old basket. Let's see, they have agave in here for $6.19. A couple videos ago, I got the big thing of agave, so I will not need that for a long time. They got a few seasonings over here. Now I do need some, um, and I don't see it, okay. I did need some uh, more of the Tony Hatcher seasoning but I don't see that in here. So that is another thing that I'll probably pick up at Winko. I see over here is like all the granola, the little snacks, cereal, things like that. I don't need any of this over here. Look at this. Whiskey baked granola with notes of cream cheese and cinnamon. I don't know how to feel about that. Those are $6.99. This one is the same thing. It says topped with raisins and cranberries though. There's Three Wishes, Original Maple Pecan. So they have a bunch of bunch of different granolas in here. There's a birthday cake granola. Ooh, and a strawberry shortcake one. That sounds good. Would you guys try this? Strawberry shortcake granola, 
$6.49 for that. Oh, this is a pumpkin spice granola. This is $4.49. Dark chocolate cashew butter, $4.49. They got a cinnamon one, mixed berry. And those are not bad priced for that. I want to say that's about as much as I pay for granola. They got a strawberry shortcake one up there too. Those ones actually sound pretty good. But I don't need granola right now because I still have a bunch of granola that I haven't used yet. They have the Magic Spoon cereal in here, $8.99. They got a bunch of flavors in here though. I've only seen about two flavors. They've got one, two, three, four, five of them in here. They got the Ghost cereal up there, $8.99 for that. All right, y'all. So I think I got just about everything that I was gonna get from the food section. And I'm gonna head over here to get some toothpaste. Oh, this is where all their snacks are over in here, but I don't need any snacks. Let's see if they have it. I hope they have it. They usually have it in here. Which ones are these? Oh, these are all kids. They have a lot of kids toothpaste, jeez. So let me see, I don't, here we go. This is the one that I usually use right here. This one is $4.99 in here, or I could get the big one for $8.99. It's on sale, yeah, for what, $1.50. This one was $5.29, it's now $4.99. So 30 cents cheaper. I'm just gonna get this one right here for $4.99. So I got my toothpaste, I got some shrimp, I got a salad, some sriracha, I got some hummus, and I got some strawberries. Y'all, I don't think I need anything else out of here. So I'm headed to the register, y'all. I haven't been in Target forever. They have a bunch of stuff in here now. They're so organized in this one too. I really like how organized they are. This one's really neat and it's really, really stocked too. Let's go see how much all this comes out to. All right, y'all, that is the end of my video. Here's everything that I got. And my total came out to $29.14, y'all. That was my total. I stayed under the $50 budget that I said I was going to go in there and spend. That is the end of the video, y'all. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see y'all all in the next video. Bye.